Good morning and welcome to the Universal Show. Can you introduce yourself this morning, please? What's up, special? Hello, everybody. I am Natasha Watts. Natasha Watts. Now, Natasha, as you know, this is the first time you've been to my show. There are a lot of people that might not be familiar with you. Also, I know you've got your hardcore soul fan base, but um, just give London and the UK and the worldwide a little insight about Natasha Watts. Who is she? Where did you come from? And your rise and how you got here today, oh, please. Oh, wow. And that's got to be quick, yeah? It's got to be... I know, okay, really yeah. quick. Um, came onto the scene 2008, Soulful House Music, had a bunch of hits. Uh, did my first album last year, went number one across the modern soul scene. Um, collaborations, gigs, concerts, worldwide, lots of travel. And now I'm here with you. Okay, <laughs> then. I like it. I like it. That was very shorthand. <laughs> very short. <laughs> well, you said it was to be quick. No, you cut a few things in there, you know. You cut a few things. So, okay, then. So, what was the initial stage or the time when you said, you know what? I want to get into music and take it seriously. Oh, okay. When was that? Um, listen, I've always wanted to sing. It's my passion since a child. But, you know, I, uh, I ended up having a child quite young and responsibilities take over and the dream gets pushed to the back burner because you have to live. So, you know, rolling forward to my 30s, that's just where we're going to stay, just mm -hmm, 30s. 30s, 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 
had people say, oh my God, it sounded better than the record, then I'm disappointed. Well, yeah. do you know what? Funny you should say that, you know? I mean, I know it's kind of slightly different. What well, on the same kind of things, though, like, um, a few, what was it, a couple of months ago, Mariah Carey done a show in um, Jamaica. Oh, did she? And apparently... 70% of the show was live and she mimed about four <gasps> tracks. What do you feel about miming as well? <laughs> I've never mimed and I'm not going to mime and I don't mime. If I can't get up out there and sing it, I shouldn't be wearing the badge singer-songwriter. It's true. Yeah. It's true. You know, true. I, I'm all about live. Talking about live. <laughs> yeah, talking about, talking about live. Talking about live. Talking about live. What's going on? What's going well, on? Well, you know, just so the listeners know that I, I'm almost sold out at the Jazz Cafe tomorrow night. Mm-hmm. Um, so, if they would like to win a couple of tickets okay they can do so no problem we're going to set a competition very very shortly because yeah. the time is running away so listen right we had george the poet on just shortly um, yeah. just a while ago right and um he brought up a very important point in yeah. fact uh, i would like to know your mm-hmm. opinion on this you know he, we were just talking about that you know we were just <laughs> talking about it right off the air yeah um he was talking about it's very very hard for black musicians in the uk what's your feeling on that with the soul scene being so small yeah. it's not recognised by the mainstream how do you feel about that? You know what it's sad because there's some absolutely amazing artists in the UK you know that I've heard mm. that I do the rounds with and you, the, the fact that they don't get the recognition the acknowledgement at, at things like the Mobos at the Brits um, is so disappointing because I thought we'd moved on but um, this country is only interested in making money in commercial music. Talk the things. And Talk, listen. <laughs> Let me take out the gun again. <laughs> no, this needs a hand grenade, all right? Oh, a hand grenade. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's, it's true. You know, no, it's I, true. listen, I'm not blowing my own trumpet, but I can know that I can go in and sing most of these pop artists under the under the table. Yeah, the problem yeah. is I'm too close to 40. I don't think it's necessarily my skin colour. It's more of an age ageism thing. Yeah, with we me. have an ageism thing it's in the ageism, UK as well. It's an That's ageism right. thing. Because right. um, I'm actually only 22, but I just lie. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I can tell you what, Tash, the, the astral cream's work is here, you know. I'm not going to lie. No, it looked like it's a boat off you this morning. Right, back in the room. So, so the thing is, it's, it, it's really sad and disheartening that they are so focused on what I call this bubblegum crap, yeah. excuse my language, but yeah. it is. You know, you turn on the... I listen to the radio driving up here and it's the same songs over and over again. Yeah. You know, no one is prepared to take a risk and go, do you know what, let's play some real soul. Because mm. there's a market for it. You know, I everyone said to me, don't sell physical copies of my album. Last year I sold nearly 4,000 physical copies of wow. my album. Wow. And that was just at gigs. Right. So if record labels think that it's that bad to invest in an older soul artist, they're stupid. Oh, because there's that. still the older market that want the albums, they want the CDs, they want the vinyls, but you're just alienating them because you don't want to put no money behind it. Pisses I, me off. I like that, I like that. She didn't say that. But listen, no, good morning. Welcome to, see, I'm drawing her out this morning. I'm drawing her out. Making me get all ghetto. <laughs> You see what happens, you see what happens. If you've just locked on this morning, we've got the lovely Natasha Watts in the building. Crazy. So tell me about some of your favourite musical influences. Then. Oh, gosh. Uh, Donny Hathaway, mm-hmm. Stevie Wonder, Jill Scott, um, Jonna Holt. Uh, I grew up in a house with lots of different music, so okay. my music taste is very eclectic. Uh, I actually did a radio the other day, and they asked for my five top tracks, and I actually stuck Cilla Black in there. And Cilla they, Black? Cilla Black. Which Any, one? Which one? Anyone who had a heart. Because oh. it was one of the first songs I learned as a child. Oh. You know, there's always a story behind everything. And I don't, I don't, um, I'm, I'm open to listening to anything. If it's good music and it's yeah. a good song, it's a good song. I, three years ago, I was in Ash, uh, Nashville writing with a country and western star. And just writing some country was just, actually, it was really therapeutic because it's it's so much about the song and they can still record into an old cassette tape and you know what the country world will accept that as a demo whereas here you gotta finish it master it they're not even interested in listening if there's Mm. one slight bit wrong because it's about the song with country and western as opposed to here it's about what market they're going to tap into and you know the image side of it which is really sad i'll tell you what do you know what don't you just feel inspired this morning pav <laughs> do you know what it's real. no do you know why i love these huh it's real no it's real no but i love it because we don't hear this information on radio 
Really? No, well, well, tell <laughs> no, me where, no, but where can I get interviews like this on the radio? I can't get it anywhere. When I get information, real information from the artists from their real journeys. Do you understand what I'm saying, Natasha? Yeah, so, it's, it's sad. Uh, it's, you know, the industry is sad, sad, and you and I have spoken quite a bit. And, yeah. You know, I... I, as an underground modern soul artist, am doing okay, mm. but I'm not making no money off music. Yeah. Because, unfortunately, the other downside of it is the illegal downloads, you know, but you, you need them to get to people, mm. which moves lovely onto my, my track that I've bought today uh, as my special gift to, okay. to my supporters. Um, you know, I don't make money off music. I do off gigs, but, you know, it's all, it's all relevant, you know. Oh, wow. It's, so it's, tell us about this tune we're this about to tune, drop exclusively this, this tune, morning is um, it's my thank you to everybody mm -hmm. so uh, I'm working with an amazing producer called Dave Doyle um, he and I got in the studios a couple of months back we came up with this track slightly inspired by one of my favourite artists but not plagiarised don't come after me um, <laughs> that's a whole other conversation another by the way okay, and okay. Um, and so this track is called Hit The Spot. Um, you are obviously going to play it first. Okay. Uh, as of tomorrow morning, the rest of the DJs on my list of Hit Squad are going to get it. And then in about four to five weeks, it will become a free download off my website, www.natashawattsmusic.co.uk. And could you introduce your single this morning, please? <laughs> this is Hit The Spot. <laughs> Thank you. 
Love it. Love it. I, oh, stop that. Stop that. <laughs> wow. I'm loving it. I'm loving it, Tash. Seriously. Thanks. So what was the inspiration behind that one? Where'd you get the vibes from that track? I'm not saying in case I get sued. You won't get sued. No, I'm not even going there. Okay. It's all, it, it, okay. it was from deep inside my soul. <laughs> no, I love it. I do love it. But listen, Go. the time is running away. Yes, I We're know. Just going to do a little quick few shout outs quickly because um, you know the listeners are going to get vexed right time. All right, listen, let me and just then, do a quick shout out. Go on, okay? in, go on, in, go on. There's go on. Uh, Krista Flyer listening, Firm Call, um, Lee, and Lee is really special because Lee is putting on So UK April the 17th at the Indigo O2, and that is for the Centre Point charity. It's myself, Donny, Omar, Lucens, Junior Giscom, Terry Walker. Um, it's going to be no, big. Plug, plug that, plug that again, Please. plug it again, plug it again. <laughs> April, April the 17th. April the 17th. Indigo O2. Is the promoter logged on? Is he logged on? I hope so. Tell him I want VIP. I'm not even playing with these guys yet. I'm we, asking for it now. Tell t- him. Tell tickets him. Tickets are selling good, and the Centre Point <laughs> charity is obviously for the homeless children. It's, okay. it's a wonderful charity. Um, we're all coming together. It's called So UK. You can check it out on souk.co.uk, I believe. Love there's it. Facebook, there's Twitter, there's everything. Get on it, get support in it. Come out, So UK. That's what it's all about. Boy, I love it. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> now, can I plug something as well then? No. See the t- <laughs> my time. <laughs> Let me plug something, because you've been plugging a lot. Let me tell you about something really special yes. then. 2nd of April, yeah? Yes. The day before Good Friday. Uh-huh. Yeah? Day before Good Friday, the Universal Show Thank You Party. Ooh, can I come? It, listen, actually, <laughs> well, you know what? Well, I was just thinking, you know, yeah. can you do a little something, something, something? A little something, something, on the something. Night, on the night. Can I can do a little something, something, something. Can you do a little something? All right, all right. Right, we so said, that's now uh, April the 2nd. April the 2nd. I'm there. Pav, is that, is it, you got that? I got it. We're going? Yeah. It's, you got it. It's, it's recorded. It's I recorded. I'm committed, right. I'm committed. Committed. April the 2nd, Natasha added to the bill for the thank you party. Yes. Right, it's taking place at the XOXO 74. For Upper Street in Angel. Oh, I don't know. I can't go North London. No, I'm I'm joking. (laughs) (laughs) I'm joking. I'm joking. (laughs) You're crazy. You're crazy. (laughs) It's from 9 to 2 a.m. Exclusive sets on the night from myself, Special K and Pablos. All right. Guest list only. Leave your names on the Universal Show at hotmail.com or you can contact myself or have lost, all right? That's for the um, universal thank you party for all those people that have been supporting the show over the years. And I must say this right now, watch out for some events in 2015 with the universal team, right? We're going to do some different things this year. Not your ordinary conventional nights. We want to do something, something different this year. Seriously. All right. Let me, let me get on to the, um, to the shout outs. Have you finished with your shout outs, Natasha? No, just very quickly. Anybody that wants to win the two tickets, right? please uh, contact me on at Natasha Watts on Twitter, yeah, stating that you listen to the show. And you're only going to win, and then I'll pick one out of the hat. It's that simple. Simple. So you heard that right here. If you want to go to Natasha Watts' exclusive show at the Jazz Cafe tomorrow, all you got to do, say it again, Tash. Hit me up on Twitter. So that's twitter.com forward slash at Natasha Watts. Natasha Watts. And let Watts. me know that you was locked in. Just say locked in. I'll stick you in the hat. Simple. I'll pull a name at random. Simple. Giving away some VIP tickets for tomorrow for Tasha's show at the Jazz Cafe, right? That's a nice evening out. Yeah, stop with, your with the VIP, oh, yeah? All right, VIP. No, well, I meant downstairs. <laughs> Look in, okay? You could imagine when they turned out. I thought you said Even VIP. Even though I'm going from time to time, you're always on my mind. Don't change your number. Oh, FM hotline is 07946. <laughs> uh, Christopher Ellis, just shush. Oh, I want to say massive shout again out to Ride Me Music. That sounds, yeah. Ride me music. I'm not saying anything. <laughs> I'm just Massive here for the comments. <laughs> Ride me music. Um, Princess Amina this morning. Big up yourself, Princess Amina this morning. Oh, she's so cheeky, you know. Yeah, she is so cheeky, man. I Don't forget, swear. you can find me on www.facebook forward slash Natasha Watts singer. Oh, oh, cheeky, sorry, had to plug it. No, keep plugging, <laughs> keep plugging. Um, massive shout out to Legs to Kill this morning. Wow. 
Legs, legs to kill, okay. What kind of listeners you got? I don't know. <laughs> They've got these kind of names. Um, Ride with me music, legs to kill. <laughs> Massive shout going out to KC this morning on the Twitter. Big up yourself, KC on the Twitter. Massive shout going out to KCC Urban Heat. All my crew up there in Liverpool logged on. Oh, I'm a, I'm a Liverpool supporter. Did you know that? So am I. I'm red. So am I. Oh, I love that. High five. Oi, oi. So you're a Liverpool <laughs> supporter as well. Yes. See? See? You see that? Can I who shout has... out to my husband who's probably listening? Log... Massive, massive shout <laughs> well, out to Well, I hope he is. Morning. Shout out to my husband. Pick up your husband. <laughs> That's really nice. simple. I like that. You big that your husband this morning. That's nice. Massive shout out to Flow Jams this morning. Um, the professionals are locked on this morning. Big up yourself, Wax and 45. <laughs> Is it Wax 45 wax and Big? I said Wax and 45. <laughs> <laughs> Wax, I know the wow. time, the time, the time. I know Wax I'm, 45. Do you know him? Yeah. You know him? Yeah. Okay, big up Wax. Tasha knows you, right? Okay. Mixmaster Jay's logged on this morning. Wow, are you Mixed that? Mixmaster Luggy. <laughs> 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 Mixmaster Jay's logged in. We've got Princess Riri logged in. Uh, who else? Who else? Who else? Who else? Who else? Come on, cook it for the names. Miss B this morning. Big shout out to Miss B. MVP, I see you. I see you. The time is running away. The time is running away. Listen. Um, massive shout out to Mr. Quick this morning. Massive shout out to my sis. Keep it up, my sis. Hey, sis. Sarita. Sarita. Sarita is logged on. There's loads of messages coming through. Too like, many. Time, you can't do time. it. Time is Listen, done. Time is done. Thank We're you for having me. It's, it's a pleasure. It's a pleasure. Oh. Kisses Listen. online. Wow, wow. <laughs> Kisses for breakfast, eh? So, um, are you going to bless me before you leave then, Tash? Huh? Are you going to bless us before you leave? Yeah, because I don't know why you're putting the mic down. Sorry, I was <laughs> just like, I just put the mic down and walked away. No, thank you, everybody. And thank you, special, for having me on your show. It's a Blesses pleasure. to you. No Have problem. a wonder wonderful Saturday. And if you don't enter to get the tickets, come down anyway. Come and see what I do. No problem. Um, you want to do a little something-something? You ready? If you want. Let's do this. Let's do it. All right, MVP's coming up in five minutes. How you doing, sir? I'm fine, you And there you go. Girls, you know what it's like when you get that real good love. <laughs> that kind of love that you want to get home to. <laughs> What's it called, guys? Big people see. You come close to me. <laughs> Feel my body breathe. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't know what's going on in here, but they've just got a bit crazy. <laughs> that sounds like some bedroom pressure business right now, you know. Oh, right, listen, it's midday, you know. It's midday. Take time. Take all right, again, again, again. Hold on, let me take off my jacket. Let me take off my jacket. <laughs> oh, was she there? No way. Wow. Kevin, you, you, you ready for this? I'm, music I'm too to Christian for this. I can't do this. <laughs> it's music to take the wallpaper off to. <laughs> He's not like joking. Whoa, FM 90.4. Natasha Watts in the building. <laughs> All right, take it away. The lady with the voice. Here we go, here we go. Won't you come close to me? Feel my body breathe. Ooh. Take me down tonight. And make me feel. Up against the wall now, Kev. Ha, ha, ha. Yeah, they're not. 
right now. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> Crazy. I'll tell you what, if you can't be good, be careful. There's, what, there's loads of messages coming in. And I'll tell you what, the time is running away. MVP is coming up after the short pause for the cause. I want to say a massive shout out to my guest this morning, George the Poet. Watch out for him in 2015. And of course, the lovely, the sensational Natasha Watts in the building. Do remember, she's in the uh, Jazz Cafe tomorrow with her sold out show. All right. Keep it where you got it. After the ad breaks, MVP in the building. If you can't be good, be careful. Peace. McGon.